ow, ow. Ow, 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 ow. Ooh, removing bandages can really hurt. And if you're like me and you have sensitive skin, the adhesive can really do a number on the skin around your wound. I've even seen adhesives rip skin when you try to take it off. And cats are no help either. So today, I'd like to talk about two alternatives to keeping your wounds covered and moist. The first option is to wrap an extremity. This is great if the wound is on your leg or your arm. So wrapping an extremity is easy. You just take some non-adherent dressing, apply your antibiotic ointment, put that on the wound, secure it with some roll gauze, and then you can secure that either with tape or you can secure it with some self-adherent wrap, which is available pretty much everywhere. There we go, we've wrapped an extremity. Another option is silicone dressings. So silicone bandages are a great alternative. They're a little bit pricier than regular bandages, but to me, they're so worth it because they don't tear up my skin. Let me show you, you just apply the silicone bandage here and it lays nicely. Another nice feature about silicone is it can be gently peeled back. So for example, if you're at your provider's office and they wanna look at the wound, and then you can simply reapply it. It's adjustable. So silicone bandages, a little bit pricier, but worth it. All of these items I used today were available at my local pharmacy, or you could shop your local DME provider, that stands for Durable Medical Equipment, or you could shop online at your favorite retailer. I'm Wound Care Karen, this is Sneezy, and this has been a Wound Healing Minute.